First of all, let, let me say thank you to my colleagues, um, uh, Chris Murphy, uh, Dick Blumenthal, um, Dick Durbin, uh, Diane Feinstein. Um, I so appreciate their advocacy on this issue. And, and then to the families, thank you for using your voices, being an advocate, and to all of the incredible organizations that are here, um, because it's something that we all know. It, it, it is not time, it is past time to reduce gun violence in this country. Th this is common sense. It's common sense. You know, I was the Attorney General, like Dick, I was a federal prosecutor, Attorney General in the state of Nevada, um, and I, I will guarantee you, um, law enforcement, and there are so many people that I know that I've worked with that support reducing gun violence, that support common sense measures that protect our loved ones, that protect our, our friends. You know, I, I'm sad to say and that Las Vegas now unfortunately has the moniker of being the deadliest site for a massacre with 58 who lost their lives, over 500 who were injured, and 22,000 innocent concert goers who were terrorized by one madman who had access to guns and didn't care how he utilized them. And I hear people say all the time, even if we had this or even if we passed that, that wouldn't have stopped what happened in Las Vegas. But I can guarantee you, if we have universal background checks, we are going to save a life. And that's what this is about. It is saving the lives in the future and ensuring we are reducing that gun violence. You know, that's why Nevada actually when I was elected, there was a ballot initiative, question one, to pass universal background checks in the state of Nevada. And it passed with the majority of Nevadans supporting it. And I will tell you, it is just common sense. I come, I come from a Nevada, uh, a family of hunters. My husband is a retired Secret Service agent. We own guns. This isn't about taking away somebody's Second Amendment rights or taking away somebody's guns. It is about passing common sense measures for gun safety to save lives. Now who could be against saving lives? Universal background checks to ensure that those individuals that shouldn't have guns do not get them, to close the private gun show loopholes, to make sure somebody cannot buy a gun on the internet without raising a red flag somewhere, or somebody ensuring that we are checking to make sure they're safe to have those guns. That's what this is about. That's what passed in Nevada, and that's why this bill is so important, because now we need to make it pass across this country. Across this country, it's time to fight. And now more than ever, I, I, I see uh, the, the advocacy in the wave of people that understand that this is just common sense. This is gun safety. This is redu reducing violence in our communities. It is about protecting our family. It is about protecting our loved ones. It is ensuring that no one, whether you're uh, seriously mentally ill, you're a terrorist, that you should not have access to weapons that can harm others. And that's why I am proud to stand here with my colleagues and co-sponsor this bill. It is time to get something done, and let's start with universal background checks in this country. Thank you all so much for your support.